Hey everybody, so it's me, Megan B, and I'm back today with another plus size clothing haul. This one is from Forever 21. I have clothes, I have purses, and I have jewelry, so we have a lot to get to. If you wanna see what I picked up, then just keep on watching. Okay, so we'll go ahead and start with clothing. The first thing I picked up is this bodysuit right here. I really love this. It's just this nice sheer material and it's burgundy and it has some velvety black floral overlays on top of it, which I think just adds some nice texture to any outfit. And I got this in a 1X, fits perfect. It has the two clasps at the bottom. And I love that the straps are adjustable because I really like to have things come up a bit higher. I just think it's more comfortable for me. So I have mine almost at the tightest fit. If you can see there, that's where I'm at. So this fits really well. And I think that this could work for many different people because of the fact that it's so adjustable. The one thing I will say is this is not something I can imagine myself just like going out to lunch and going out to dinner in. It feels kind of like I'm wearing lingerie. So I'd have to wear this with something that is a little bit more covered up but it is super cute. I tried it on with a black bralette and I, I really liked the way it looked. I never really buy jeans or pants online and today I was reminded why. <laughs> I got these black jeans, they're high-waisted and they have this kind of lace-up detail down the sides that has been really popular. You would think that once it gets to the top it would be more of an illusion that it's open, but it's completely open so you could totally see your underwear, which I don't think is the cutest look ever. I got these in a size 14, you guys know that I'm kind of in between a 12 and a 14, it just depends. And these. They just did not fit me well. I liked that there was room in the stomach because once again, I'm apple shaped, but it felt like there was some random sagging throughout the back and like kind of in the front as well. And the bottom of the bottoms of the pants were just not fitted at all on the calves. So it kind of just looked like a frumpy mom jean, not my favorite at all. So I definitely am going to return these, but first I need to remove all of the cat hair. Life of cats. <laughs> this one right here. It's this knitted kind of sweater vest almost in a way. That's the back. I love the color of this. This like sage green I just think is like perfect for fall. The sides have these two ties that are adjustable so you can have it as open and as closed as you would like. I tried it on with it pretty um, closed so that was nice. You could still see my bralette through it but it wasn't anything where it was like crazy revealing and open. The bottom is a little bit cropped and I felt like it was a bit longer in the back, just by a little bit. Maybe it was because of the way I had it tied or because naturally things are gonna sit higher on me in the front. But I just really loved this. I think it's so comfortable. And I got this one in a size 1X. Super cute. For some crazy reason, I have been gravitating towards yellow. So when I saw this top, I kind of just like automatically fell in love and picked it up. It's just this yellow crop top and it's off the shoulder. The zipper in the front comes all the way down and it does adjust. So be careful that nobody accidentally <laughs> takes the whole thing off of you. My boyfriend made fun of me when I said that because he was like, why? But anyways, <laughs> I think this is really cute. It fits really nice and snug. I got this in a 0x. I probably could have used a 1x, but it is comfortable, so no big complaints there. It hits at a good point in the bottom, and also the sleeves are quite a bit long, so I am going to have to bunch them up. I tried to show that in the try-on haul, so you can kind of see that there, but I still really like it, and I still think I'm going to get a lot of use out of this tucked into some dark wash jeans. Like, that would be so cute. I tried it on with leggings in this try-on haul bit, so I kind of look like a bumblebee, but I'm not really that mad at it. item it's this piece right here 
It's just this white sweater that has kind of boxier sleeves, a v-neck, and it's a bit cropped in the front and longer in the back. It also has that lace-up detail on the sides. I've just been loving that clearly. Um, it says on here that it's an XL, but on the site I believe it was a 0X, but this isn't from the actual Forever 21 brand. I'm not really sure. Let's see what it says. It says uh, Selfie Couture by Trendology, so I guess that's like a company they're working with. I will say that this is so cute, but the material feels a bit weird. It is like a lightweight knit, but it almost feels like, you know when you go to the beach and you go to those like cheaper beach stores and it, I just can't describe the knit feeling, but it just doesn't feel that soft or nice, but I love it anyways. I think the way it looks is really cute and that this is like a good transitional piece for definitely like fall to winter. bags I got this little bucket purse right here it's just burgundy and it has like gold hardware on it I like that it has a smaller handle right here but then a nice large strap I pretty much only wear shoulder strap bags because I don't like to like hold this I just think it looks cute <laughs> and then I like how you can kind of cinch it in so that all your stuff is kind of protected just with these two little strings right here this is super cute I mean it doesn't look like I spent a crap ton of money on it so it's like not the craziest quality but I think this is perfect for just like pairing with an outfit where you just need a pop of color and the burgundy color obviously works perfect for the fall so I think it's worth it it's worth you're getting what you pay for basically and I like the gold detailing because I'm definitely a gold person now for the last bag this is like a giant <laughs> tote bag right here I wasn't expecting this to be so large but that's okay I know I have a lot of stuff that I can fit into here anyways it's just a very basic, simple bag. I needed something that was brown because I have quite a few black bags, but hardly any brown at all. I don't even think I have a single one, so I know this one will be perfect to pair with a lot of my other outfits. The opening is very large. There's some nice zippers on the inside. This will be a perfect bag for like using as a carry-on when you're going on a flight or something. And also, I like how it has these little straps right here, just to add a little bit of design to it since it's so basic and kind of plain. Now onto jewelry. I'm actually wearing some of the jewelry that I got, but I'll explain later. So the first thing I got is this silver necklace right here. It's like called a snake necklace, I believe, which is just meaning it's a thicker chain. So I hope you can kind of see. I wanted to get some silver jewelry because I really have hardly any. And I like having necklaces that are a bit more of a choker, but nothing too crazy tight, which is what I think this is perfect for. And I'm a simple jewelry kind of girl. I don't love like crazy huge statement necklaces. I used to, but it's just not my thing anymore. So I got this one and then I'm wearing the same exact one in gold right now. Okay, I also picked up this huge pack of bangles. I wear Alex and Ani bracelets all the time, bangles all the time. Once again, my jewelry style is very simple. So having just like these cute little bangles on my wrist, I think adds a little bit something extra to my outfit without being crazy loud or like too gaudy for lack of a better word. I hope that, I hope that makes sense. Last but definitely not least are my favorite thing that I got and it's these rings right here. I have them in silver, but then I'm also wearing them in gold. I'm obsessed with these. I love the look of wearing like a lot of rings and these are perfect because they come in like a smaller size at the top and then it goes down to like a bigger size which will fit on your finger all the way down here. So I have really fat fingers. <laughs> they look like sausage links basically. But even for my fat fingers, the large size fits so it should fit pretty much everybody else. I really like these. I think they're just once again a simple thing that adds something extra to your outfit and I've already worn them so much. I will say though, be careful, they're so easy to lose. I've already lost probably about like five or six of them in the gold pack, but these ones are still going strong and I really like them. <laughs> Okay, so that's everything I have to share with you guys today. Like always, comment down below what your favorite piece was and give me some recommendations of where your guys' favorite places to shop are so that way I can film some more hauls for you in the future. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please follow me on Instagram, by the way. I'm gonna have it written right here for you. It's just Megan B with two N's because yeah, I feel like I have a lot of creepy guys following me and not that many people who are actually following me for like fashion reasons or something. But anyways, once again, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.